Good morning, I'm Celeste Mitsu. Graham Arnold concedes a Matt Ryan era cost us at the World Cup in Qatar. The Socceroos will make their way home after losing to Argentina 2-1 in the round of 16. An emotional Jackson Irvine says he hopes they've made Aussies proud. Uh, oh yeah, just not enough on the day. We did everything we could have. Um, we set up to be compact and disciplined in our shape. We were excellent defensively. We gave up very little until obviously the end you have to have a go. While it was a bit of mixed reactions from the Socceroos faithful in Doha. Look, really, there's two goals we should have put in and there's one goal we shouldn't have let in. Simple. It's, there really, really wasn't much in it. Tough result, really tough result. Boys done really well. Yeah. Everyone in Qatar has been excellent. The Aussie spirit was on tonight. Try a career in defence. The defence minister is encouraging teams to sign up, saying our skills gap is the biggest risk to the country. Thousands of roles need to be filled over the next decade. Influencers caught promoting a type 2 diabetes weight loss drug online have been put on notice. The TGA has issued a stark warning saying they will be fined of up to $1.1 million. South Australians are preparing for more river rises. Renmark is set to peak in a fortnight's time, impacting more than 2,000 homes. And COVID cases are spiking in aged care facilities. As of Friday, 43,000 were reported in the sector nationwide and an additional 58 deaths. What would you do with a dollar? Did you know that for every one dollar donated to Food Bank, two meals are created? Head to foodbank.org.au. Australia is closing in on victory over the West Indies in the first test in Perth, needing only seven wickets on day five. Marnus Lubbershane is only the third Aussie to have scored a century and a double ton in the same test. Hear every ball live on Triple M from 12.30 Eastern Standard Time. Adam Scott holds a one-stroke lead heading into day four of the Australian Open. Cameron Smith has fallen out of contention. And the AFL has locked in round one of the fixture. Arch rivals Richmond and Carlton open the season with a Thursday night one last start for March 19th. Coming cloudy across the limestone coast today, a top of 32. Cooler tomorrow, the chance of a shower and 17. Cloudy on Tuesday, a top of 19. It's the daily stories that matter in under 20 minutes. Search the briefing podcast on Listener. Download the app now and listen for free.